Hey guys, it's me again, Vanellope. Um, if you are one of my subscribers, I suggest you stick around. There's going to be a message to my subscribers at the end of this video. If you are not one of my subscribers, but we, but you would like to sub to me, I do sub for sub. So if you want a, so if you want a subscription, then just click that that little button down below and. Feel free to personal message me once you've done so, and I will get back to you on that. Now, without any further ado, we're going to get right into it. And for those of you who are here for the movie reviews, this is not the video for you. This is just some messages that I had from the weekend, because a few things happened this, this weekend, and I just wanted to update you guys a little bit. First of all, I obviously went to Almont this weekend, so no, there was no video this weekend. There was going to be some kind of vlog, um, another, you know, looking through a bag or something, but I didn't end up doing that because I wasn't at Almont all weekend at my grandparents' farm. And it was my grandmother, it was my grandmother's birthday. Well, it wasn't actually, her, her birthday is actually today, and she's turning 65, but... Um, we had, like, a little party, and, you know, there was some food there, and there was actually stuff, there was actually some interesting stuff there, and, you know, Swedish and lamb meatballs, and all that stuff. And then, um, yeah, they had a bunch of other stuff there, too, and there was just a bunch of appetizers, and then there was some delicious chocolate cake. With actually, instead of icing, they put like dark chocolate on the outside, like melted dark chocolate, I think, and then they let it harden. So it was really delicious. Um, and by the way, the um, they had stuffed pasta there, and that was pretty much the only thing I liked, aside from the cake, obviously. And that yeah, it was pretty much the only thing I liked. And then I asked how they made it, so I could make it at home, and they said there was eggplant and cheese in it. And, which is really interesting, because I don't usually eat vegetables and things. And it tasted like there was meat in it, seriously. It didn't even have, um, it didn't even have, like, a, it, yeah, it didn't even have, like, any meat in it. It tasted like meat, but it was freaking eggplant. And, yeah, it was crazy. And so, I just, yeah. <laughs> um, oh, by the way, did you guys know that, did you guys know that um, male eggplants have a flat bottom and female eggplants have a round, a more round, a curvy bottom? Yeah, I didn't learn this. I didn't learn that piece of information till this weekend. But it's very interesting. I did not know there were male and female eggplants. And I did not know how to tell the difference between the two. And you should look for the male eggplant if you want one that's sweeter. Because the male eggplants don't have seeds in them. And the seeds make them bitter. So that... So that is why the male eggplants are sweeter. So just look, so just look for the one with the flat bottom. I mean, c could you seriously? Could you imagine going to the grocery store and asking the guy who works there, "Hi, I'm looking for a male eggplant." He would be like, "What the hell are you talking about?" Yeah. So there was a little bit of that, and um, it was a fun party, and it was a good time. And, Obviously, I was a little stressed. It always stresses me out going on road trips and changes and stuff like that. But I handled it really well, I think. And my mom seems to think so, too. And so did my grandparents and, and Joanna, my aunt. Oh, yeah. I, yeah, I met my aunt this weekend. Well, she's more of my step-aunt. She's, she's actually my grandmother's son, but it's not... I mean, daughter... <laughs> Yeah, um, so she's my mom's stepsister, and she's actually my aunt. So it's very, very cool, and so she's like my step-aunt, and I'm, I never met her before, and I met her this weekend, and she's really nice, and she's cool, and she even has black hair, which is really funny, because there's a character named Joanna in one of my books who has black hair. Um... Yeah, and, um, you know, there was a lot of that stuff going on this weekend, and obviously I wasn't able to get together with my boyfriend because of, um, because of being six and a half hours away in Almont. I mean, well, I don't know if it was six and a half hours, it may not have been that far, 
But, you know, we just hung out, and I just hung out on the Wi-Fi mostly, and I watched a lot of Max Mofo, and, you know, <laughs> his videos are funny, and, you know, his mail times, and his prank calls, stuff like that. I also listened to um, some creepypastas, Mr. Creepypasta, off of YouTube, because I like him, too. And, yeah, and there was that, and, you know... And my room is still a mess, as you can see. And yeah, it's a lot of a mess. It needs a lot of work. And yeah, I really, I haven't even unpacked yet, except for a couple of little things. Um, but I haven't unpacked, like, any of my clothes or anything like that. And yeah, I'm just sitting here being random right now, so, you know. And I would just like to give a big thank you to everyone who subscribed to me. I did gain four subscribers over the weekend, so that is something very amazing, very cool. And yes, I got ten. I got. I. I'm, I have nine subscribers now, and I think when I get to the ten subscriber special, I'm gonna have to do like a giveaway or something. I'm gonna. Yeah, I'm gonna think of something. <laughs> But, um, yeah, but a bit, just a huge thank you to all of my subscribers. You guys are all awesome, and I would like to give a, a shout out to one subscriber in particular, Sexy Gamer Girl, with, it has, except it has two threes instead of E's, and she has, um, not only did she subscribe to me, but she messaged, she PM'd me saying, nice channel, and she also PM'd me and told me that I could promote herself, pro promote myself on her channel, which most people wouldn't do, and she also told me if I wanted a shout out to PM her, and she'd give me a shout out, and yeah, so she's just been really nice, she's been a great supporter, she's been really supportive, you know, when I'm getting my channel in action, and trying to get you guys to come watch my channel and stuff like that. She's been really supportive, she's been really helping me out, I, I have not seen her video yet, but, well, yeah, I watched, I did watch some of her video, it's, it's pretty cool, I think you guys should go check it out. Uh, yeah. I, I did watch her video, I did watch some of her video, and it's pretty cool, I suggest you guys go check it out, I'm actually gonna leave the link in the description, um, down below. But, if you guys are just here for the movie, oh, okay, wait, one more thing before I forget. So, in case you're wondering what that sign at the top is, cause it wasn't there before, and it's because I have, um, a very special family member coming soon, it's a Rouge the Bat plush, and I've wanted one for a very, very long time, and, um, yes, I've wanted one for a really long time, and so finally I found this, um, site online that, where this girl custom makes them, her name is Lita Mitchell, and she custom makes Sonic, um, plushies and other toys and stuff like that, it's very cool, very high quality, you know, good prices, <laughs> And yes, I'm still getting over being sick. But anyway, yeah. So she custom makes the toys, and then she, like, she sends them to you, to your house. And my, um, my Wish with Bat plush, I wasn't expecting it to be here till August, but actually, actually, it shipped this weekend. Why was it? Well, I was at, um, at my grandparents' farm. It was very special, it was very cool, and I'm really excited about having her here at the end of June. And she's, yeah, I'm guessing she's probably going to get here before the end of June. And, you know, obviously school is also over in a few weeks, so that's going to be pretty cool. Well, we're going to have you, we're going to have her here much sooner than expected. That is great, I think it's going to be so great, and I'm really, really excited. So I just made that little sign for her that says Welcome Rouge the Bat and I I made it today while I was in school and you know I colored in the letters myself and then I cut them out and I taped them to that thing and then I hung it I like blue tacked it on my wall. But if you guys are just here for the movie review then you know check out the movie review it's going to be the next video it's not going to be the same one this is like a bunch of this is just like a message 
just a, just a random message. Once again, if you would like to subscribe to me, I do sub for sub. So if you so if you want a subscription, then just subscribe to me and then put and then personal message me or PM me. All right, and we'll you know we'll I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, big shout out to Sexy Gamer Girl. I suggest you guys go check out her video. It's very cool, and she's very, she she's been very supportive of me in trying to get myself out there and trying to get my YouTube career started. And yeah, it's just it's just been really great having her as that kind of support. So I really suggest you guys go check her out. And yeah, and that's basically all I have to say. So I'm gonna get out of here. Um, yeah, I'm gonna do, obviously I have a few videos coming out that you guys might want to check out. I have the 25 things you should know about me, the bonus video, 25 more things you should know about me. I also have, like, a, another look in my, to my stuffed animal collection coming out soon. You know, I, obviously I have a movie review every week, every Monday. Tomorrow is Trivia Tuesday, so check back in for the, um, for the trivia question, and... Alright, so that's about it, and I'm going to get out of here, and then um, the next video that I'm going to put up is going to be the movie review. Okay, bye!